hi guys welcome back to new strength you're listening to the eagle online if you haven't subscribed please do all of that now let us get into the discussion of today the national electricity grid has collapsed again this if we're counting it properly is the fourth time this year in just 2024 it is the fourth time that this national electricity grid is collapsing they say it's partial collapse is this is that but we don't have lights we don't want to hear all the stories give us lights fuel is expensive fuel is scarce even people that have the money now have to queue up in lines to buy it or you are blind eh, eh. see what nigeria is making me do i'm speaking english or you are buying black markets fuel is expensive fuel is scarce food prices have gone crazy in the market and then this process is even another thing that we're still discussing till today, even after the president has addressed Nigerians, because nobody's smiling. And then you come and tell us again that national greed, national greed, what's about the national electricity? What is the problem? What made it collapse? Why can't people just structuralize something and do it once and for all and do it good? The first time it collapsed, you'd not, you'd not make it, you know, stand properly again. Second time, third time, fourth time. Even after they say third time is the charm, you still let it enter the fourth time. We're still addressing it. You don't want to give us light. Parts of, there was no light in my area yesterday. I don't know about you, whether you had light in your area. But there was no light in my area. And I do not like that for anything. What do you mean after all the daily stress, after every single thing? I'll come back and then I'm still fuel that there's, there's no fuel though. The one that we're managing, I'll still come and turn on lights and um, generator. From morning till night again because this country has refused to do something right it's tiring it's really it is genuinely tiring it is it is so sad giving i would even say it's giving other people to mock us at this point because even nigerians are, are mocking this said government it's frustrating when something cannot cannot work we're still battling so many other things and then we're still coming to talk about lights why other countries that have 247 light, they don't have two heads. Though. The one that you're managing to flash once in a while, we're still discussing it. Um, from a source in the transmission company of Nigeria said that, oh, it was just a partial collapse. I don't want to swear, but which kind of, we don't care if it's a partial collapse. It's not, it can't be only me, but we do not care if it is a partial collapse. Do it and do it right. You are not. You are barely even giving us the light. What is making it collapse? Is it is the building not strong? Be is it not strong enough? What was built there? Is it not strong enough that it is collapsing? And this is the fifth collapse. This twenty twenty four, not even fourth. The fifth collapse twenty twenty four. Then I was even saying fourth. It was misjudged because I did not understand properly that this is the fifth time, not even the fourth. The fifth time in one year. Ha! You people should please. I beg, help us. We're tired. We're tired. Let us know the one that we are doing in this country. An evil man will say, Kaima in Kaina. Eh? You are hitting us from too many places. Ha ah, ah. This same government, these same people, citizens, masses that you have promised to come and rule and govern in a proper way. Is this how it is done? Now we need to do better. People that are in charge of this, that is the the transmission company of nigeria that people that are in charge of this whole light thing they should get it sorted once and for all five times is too much now in one year one year and this is just the eight months in the year it's not as if okay the year is about to round up and they have even broken it it's, even if you say you want to break it quarterly it's still no reach he pass ha. please let us know the protest still has how many more days to go till saturday that's the 10th even after the president has addressed the nation Nobody wants to calm down. People's blood is boiling. And you still want to open your mouth and be telling us that. National grid. What's it happened to national grid? Please, let it be fixed. Let it be sorted out once and for all. Let us know that, okay, we're not battling light. At least we're still seeing light. As in amidst of the many other things that we're going, we're facing in this country. That's going to be all for now, guys. Trust me, I'm going to any further update on this matter. Hopefully, it is fixed. We'll see it. If I don't need to come back and tell you that it has been fixed, we'll have lights. We'll, be, we'll see it. Ah. That's going to be all for now. If you haven't subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting for. Subscribe, like, and share. And I will see you on the next one. Bye for now. Good morning, Nigeria. Today is the hunger day. 
we all promise you that we are going to be on the street of Abuja. And hunger has brought me out. I can't. I don't have money to buy fuel. I don't have money to buy whatever. There's total bad government. And I think I'm encouraging each and every one of us that the government has used propaganda, fake news, to tell you that the protests have cancelled. Look at us on the street. The protests are not cancelled. We are on the street. It's 10 days. And if our demand is not being made, we will remain on the street till our demand is being made. Hunger has brought me out. Insecurity has brought me out. Poor housing has brought me out. A lot of things that is